Now, come closer so the microphone picks up, you know, the information. Okay, but I want to go both of your heads as well, so can you sit yes. a little closer? Very good. Great. So, here we are at uh, Nablus and uh, Dalman Streets at a vigil in support of the Palestinian homes that are threatened with being taken over by some uh, illegal court actions uh, which are claiming that there was uh, a couple of uh, homes here that used to be lived in by Sephardic Jewish uh, people a long time ago and they're using this as an excuse to take over your home. So is this the uh, situation, uh, this is the condition that you find yourself in now? Um, okay. Um, the, the issue of my neighborhood started at 1948 when Israel start, uh, started the first war between the Arab and Israel. And uh, as you know, Israel or uh, 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 the, the uh, uh, terrorism uh, like uh, Menachem Begin, the Prime Minister of Israel at 1976 or 7, uh, they killed a lot of people uh, from uh, uh, Palestine and they refugee the people uh, or they, uh, they make them to, to throw to uh, Jordan or Syria or Lebanon, as you know, where uh, uh, the refugees uh, come in, in uh, uh, that uh, countries. Um, the Palestinian families here in Sheikh Jarrah, all of them is uh, refugees, people from uh, 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 the land in uh, 1948, I mean the land of Palestine. Um, the United Nations decided to build a new neighborhood for the uh, refugees people uh, uh, just to help uh, uh, the people, the Palestinian people. At 1952, they end to build 28 uh, houses and they make agreement with uh, the Palestinian families, um, with the Jordanian government. It means there's three sides. It's the Jordanian government and the United Nations and the Arab uh, or Palestinian families. They make exchange with the United Nations to, uh, uh, to exchange uh, the refugee card with that apartment, a small apartment. It was only seven by seven meters. At 1973, when Israel annexed it, East Jerusalem to West Jerusalem, and they uh, advertise that there is no East and West, it's only one Jerusalem, or the big Jerusalem. The first settlers association claimed that land, it's belong to them. After four years in the Israeli court, they lose the case because they don't have any document uh, to prove them on on the land. They sold the area. They sold um, maybe the right of the area to another settlers association. At 2006, the Israeli court decided that for both, there is no enough document to prove the own on the land. So they keep the situation without any change. The Israeli um, the, the, the settlers decided to sell the rights again to another settlers association in 2006. The situation in the region allowed to Israel to kill to transfer, to do anything against the Palestinian community, and nobody uh, check uh, the, this small state. Because we talk about Israel, and it's the uh, uh, full right of Israel to defend itself. But I want to ask the, the, uh, 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 the world, all of the world, 
to defend itself, it means to transfer the Palestinian people, to transfer the Palestinian community, specifically in East Jerusalem? No. We don't, we don't agree with Israel because we know it's our full right to be here. And we're talking now about all of uh, uh, the, uh, 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 the Palestinian territory. Even the Palestinian uh, leader, I mean Abu Mazen and Mr. Yasser Arafat, agree to separate the state, I mean Palestine, for uh, two states, but Israel wants to Judaize the state. To Judaize the state, it means they want to transfer all of the Palestinian community from East Jerusalem. Now we are 300,060 300, people, and they want to transfer all of us. It's, Israel doesn't care where we have to go, to Jordan, maybe to Iraq or to Egypt. Really, they, they don't care. But at 2008, they uh, uh, succeed to evict, to evict the first family. Um, after 10 days, uh, uh, the guy died because he cannot uh, uh, stand the suppression. And at 2009, uh, the Israeli court decided to evacuate us. I mean, they want to evacuate 37 people from my family and 17 people from the other family in Sheikh Jarrah. At 2000, the 2nd of uh, 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 August 2009, they came at 4.50 in the morning with all of, I think, all of the uh, Israeli uh, uh, a military to evacuate my family and they, they don't try to, to provide anything because the plan is to throw the families to Ramallah or uh, 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 any place of the uh, Palestinian Authority. At the day one we started to, to demonstrate down there in front of my house, and uh, uh, we, we stayed there for seven months in a small tent in the front of my house. But the Israeli government, the municipality uh, of Jerusalem, uh, they don't like it to, uh, um, to protest against the, uh, uh, the wall or uh, the water or uh, um, uh, uh, our mask, Al-Aqsa mask. <coughs> Sorry. They don't like it. They took the tent 17 times. Every time uh, uh, they, they took the, uh, the tent, they was arrested some people from my family. Also the fees. But after seven months, we cannot stay here because the weather, it started to, to uh, rain, and it was very difficult for us because there's uh, children, and uh, they, they started to be uh, sick. Okay. Uh, this demonstration started uh, six uh, years ago, and we will continue to struggle against the apartheid of that state uh, to protest against the wall, the water, uh, the services of uh, uh, the municipality office of Jerusalem. They just know how to collect your money and they don't care for where you have to get it. And uh, the situation really in East Jerusalem very, very bad. The situation going from bad to worse, I mean, because Israel just push and push with non-stop against the Palestinian community. We hope that all of the world can help us 
uh, to return my, my family back to my house and the other families in Sheikh Jarrah and to end the occupation. I want to say something for all of the world. If is it in USA or Canada or France or Britain, in Palestine, if there is no peace, it means no peace in all of the world. Because here, Palestine is the center of uh, the peace. And uh, uh, all we want is only peace. We don't want or we don't need more wars. It's enough. The, the, the first war uh, uh, in 1948, 67, uh, 73, 82, 2000, 2002, 2004, 2006, 2008, 12, and uh, 40. All of these wars, Israel started to attack. Actually, who want this war? It's Israel. Maybe they want to, to, to see more uh, bloods in the area. And the Israeli government should know that if there is no peace in my house, in my country, in my uh, neighborhood, there is no peace in all of the uh, places, all, all of uh, in the, uh, the world, uh, around the world, I want to say. Yeah, but... Okay, this is the, this is the situation, and uh, I hope that Israel can understand that enough for wars. Yeah. Can I ask you one question? Yeah. Can you tell the, the public how long your family lived in the house? Uh, actually, uh, we lived in the house uh, since 1952 till 2009. From 1952 till 1973, there is no body claim that my house or it's my land or the, you you sit here on my land and if you want to 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 pay rent or something like this, nobody, because the plan of Israel is to transfer the Palestinian people. They came with the order evictions and they implemented. That's it. And where did your family come? from in 1952? Yeah, my 1948. In, yeah, 1948, yes. remember? Yes. Yeah. My family came from Sarafand. In Sarafand, my family, we have a, a, we had a, a, a 18 dunams of citrus. It means my family, it's not poor family. There was a very rich family. The Jewish came and took all of the land and the money and you know uh, because uh, the, the Arab armies they said uh, you can go out from the country for one week or two weeks we want to end the Jewish or the case of the Jewish and you come back to your house you mean the Jewish Zionists yeah 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 if it's the Zionism or uh, the, the Jewish, it's not uh, very important, you know, because um, if we're talking about the Jewish or the Jewish Zionism, it's really uh, uh, the same body. Yeah, it's not it's here. Not, it is yes. Now, yeah. um, Sefran, where your family originally came from, where you had the. Uh, had the citrus farm, the 20 dunams. 18. 18 dunams. Yes. Where, how far away is that? Where um, is that located? It's only 45, 47 kilometers from Jerusalem. Ah. It's beside uh, Lut. Be oh, next to Lut. Yeah. Yes. Now, if you went to court and asked for your land back, what would happen? Uh, my father tried to, to claim in the Israeli courts I want my land back. You know, the, the, the Israeli court, they just they refused to take the file from my father or the claim from my father. And they said, if 
you want tra- your land, it means Israel out and you want to back to your land. Yeah. And so they refuse to accept uh, yeah. your legal motion. Yeah. But that's not legal. Y- you know. Yeah, that's the way it is. I understand. Yeah. Okay, we'll tell everybody about this. Very good. Thank you. Thank you. You're okay, she